Hi, it's Michael Friedman here, and I just wanted to share with you today a great plugin that I found uh, actually just searching through YouTube, which is a, a great source of uh, reference. Anyway, so what, what it's called is uh, Tiny MCE Advanced, and what it is, it's, uh, it, it expands your toolbar for WordPress editing of your posts. And as you can see, I have the advanced toolbar up here already. But let's start from the beginning, and let's just see how we go about getting that. So just in your... Um, navigation side on your on your I guess on your left sidebar in your WordPress uh, administration functions press plugins and hopefully it's your computer's a little faster than mine there we go and add new at the top here you see press that and in the search the plugins just press just type in I should say tiny it's already here but you see tiny MCE and that'll get you where you want to go. So as you see, I've already installed it, but it's Tiny MCE Advanced. Now, uh, using this as an example, you would just press Install Now, except up here at the Tiny MCE uh, Advanced, and then that would take care of everything. Also, you'll notice uh, I don't have it showing up here, but you'll notice uh, on the top after you've done that, there'll be uh, a, a, a prompt to empty your cache. You should always do that. It makes your computer browsing within your blog much, much more efficient for the visitor. And it by no means does any um, damage to, or you're not losing any information that you needed to have by, by doing that. So, okay, we've installed it. It's there. You know, you pressed uh, install. It's there. Now you can go to settings to make some uh, additional additions to it. So you know, again, in the left sidebar, you'll find settings. Scroll down to you see your tiny MC advanced. A little slow today. And you see you have the standard features of the tiny MC buttons uh, arrangement, but you can add all sorts of additional features to it. Do note, though, that adding too many buttons will make your toolbar too long and will not display correctly in your uh, uh, post editing. Uh, so here we go. So I'm just going to take you back to mine. I've selected the ones that I wanted to use specifically. I wanted font size, font family, and some additional things that you'll see when we go back here, which I'm going to show you by starting to create a new post. And let's go here, add new. Here we go. So what I've added, as you see before, in previous uh, year in your Word, in WordPress editor, you didn't have the option of font size. What you had was just a format, and you can just do, you know, and you see here headings, one, two, three, four, five, six, indicated your font size. This is much, much more flexible and uh, better to use. Also fonts, small selection, but all the less more than what you had before. All the better. Uh, once again, and you know, subscripts and uh, so forth, emoticon icons. You know, you can just you can add an emoticon right here. You know, whatever. And you and what you, you as you see it here, it, this it's not a graphic image yet. But to do that, just another little trick here. So it shows up when you save your draft or you save your post. Go to writings. Um, which is okay, I don't care if I lose that for now. And let's quickly go here. I guess quickly is an understatement here. Make sure you've pressed or checked off convert emoticons like this, and it'll, that emoticon that you just saw will display back as a graphic. But anyway, here's your advanced toolbar now. And as I said, you can add many more um, functions to it as you find useful for your own uh, editing. And just to take you backwards, it's once again in TCMC Advanced. You just virtually bang it up there and put it there, and it's done. You've got it in your toolbar. So as many as you want to take from here, you can add up into here and increase your toolbar. As you see it, this is three, four lines here. When you actually um, install it, it comes down to two. So that's it for now. I hope that you found this useful, and if you uh, do find it useful, I hope you'll tune in for further uh, updates and tips.